One company is looking to expand its business on the water, but they might have sailed a little too far from shore. Coast TV News reporter Kevin Zappé shows us why the Ocean City Council may sink their idea. Ocean City is a densely packed part of our coast. When the weather is good, there are a lot of people and a lot of cars. And a new business plan for the company Sea Rocket would add even more housing, which has Richard Kress worried about overcrowding. Oh my God, parking. <laughs> Great place for a bicycle. Sea Rocket, who currently do speedboat rides in Ocean City, are looking to expand their business by offering housing too. They're looking to add these houseboats in downtown Ocean City on Dorster Street, offering people an opportunity to be rocked to sleep by ripples and waves of the Asawoman Bay. I talked to one local in Ocean City who didn't want to appear on camera, but told me that he thinks it would be a cool idea to have in Ocean City and that he would definitely rent out at night. But the Ocean City Council says this can't be an option. Officials told the company that no floating structures are allowed around that area, saying, quote, Dorster Street and the surrounding streets are in the downtown Marine District, and floating structures are not permissible pursuant to the town's code in that district. But Sea Rocket responded by saying they aren't breaking any code whatsoever, saying, quote, We believe the use of the marina slips at the former marina deck restaurant for the vessels is authorized by the town's zoning code. As these two sides battle back and forth, all Crest is worried about is the parking. The, the density of housing, the density of transient housing in this area is huge. And so if you add to that density by putting more houses out on the water, it's just hard to imagine. On May 6th, the Ocean City Council will be discussing the codes currently in place and what steps they should take next. I'm Kevin Zappé in Ocean City, Coast TV News.